Look at the starting lineup, Serge Dinkota, who's coaching Portland Timbers too, has this 11. Mikolai Biginski is in goal today. Alejandro Cano, Sean Bitter, Oscar Verhoeven lead the defense. That will be an opportunity now for the town to bounce back. But it's Portland in their beautiful greens that kick us off and get us started from Providence Park here in Oregon. Into the game, in the end, the men of LA Galaxy second team, too much, a 2-1 win. Timbers, too, had a tough 2-1 defeat in the, but they did not progress. However, their last league game was one that had plenty of positives and promise, a nil-nil draw against Real Monarchs. So, it was the Monarchs who won on kicks from the spot, five to four. Dan DeGear Light said it was a good test for us, had a good team out there, and they had good moments, not just defensively, but and in the attacking third. He thought a draw might have been a fairer as a Portland's winning pedigree. They just have those high standards constantly. Serge Dinkota plans to keep those standards just as high, if not higher as the town are in behind here, and out of nothing, they've taken the lead. Aaron Edwards. In the blink of an eye, gives the visitors a one nil lead with the beauty of a finish. Now Portland with a giveaway here in the midfield, and Aaron Edwards, talk about something out of nothing from the edge of the penalty area. He smashes it past Miller. All of a sudden, the town with the lead, looking for more. Inside of the opening, six minutes here in Portland. Very good service, it's Edwards again, and it's headed off the line. May have been going wide, but Portland weren't gonna take any chances. It wasn't a bad header whatsoever from the goal scorer, it just didn't look like the town could be in again. They look for a second goal and the offside flag is up. After Julian Donnery maybe took too many touches inside the 18 yard box. At the moment, the town swarming Timbers two here. Aaron Edwards from San Jose, California. Quite a few players on this team. Played collegiately at UCLA last season and had to make the playoffs on decision day. Ended up getting that sixth seed, but did not progress in the playoffs. And that was one thing that, another corner upcoming. Great ball in, it was a free header inside the penalty area. Alejandro Cano missing the target. Portland had progressed in the Open Cup, which unfortunately for them did not come to pass. And it's a lovely little dummy by Edwards. First time ball into the penalty area. He's needing of a touch. His first goal with the club. What a moment for him. I must say again, it was a really well taken strike. And Timbers too looking for a rebuttal. It was... The town keep on pushing, however. Corner is there. Edwards with the header. Appeals for a handball. It was deflected out for another corner. Edwards again. Here's Chow. And again, it's Edwards. Good save. Oh, rebound hits the frame. Miller thwarts him the first time. Aaron Edwards on the follow up. It could get better for them even still. Nice run through a few defenders there from Cave Rod. And a nice little give back, and the shot hits the post on Eisenberg's attempt. The touch to this, referee says it's out for a corner. Linares, beautiful skill. Eisenberg, unlucky. Portland play through, Johnston. Spearing one out to this far side, Linares. Couple of ball rolls, it's still Linares across the face. But nobody in green to get a touch. Blancas, fouled, free kick. That's Victor Velasquez, has his pocket picked. Blancas, 
First time ball in, is headed just wide. Riley Lynch nearly adding on to the town's advantage. Linares. Maybe a chance here, Eisenberg. Unleashed a decent effort. They've really done quite a bit of damage in this first half. Great partnership. Here's Linares for Portland. Trying to change the tide at the end of the half. Nice run by Eisenberg across the face of goal. Great save. Bogansky keeps it out as Penn put it on frame. That's the closest Portland has come. And it really put Dan DeGeer's boys in charge. From the set piece, it's whipped in. Neville is there to head it up into the air. Garcia gets it back again from Neville. And sends in a good ball. Edwards is header back across. No one attacks it. It falls in the middle. And then the goalkeeper makes the save. And then it's ricocheted around a second time. And it goes wide. You talk about pinballing. More beautiful build-up play from the town. Blanc is into the middle. Edwards couldn't quite get up to it. Verhoeven keeps it in, or does he? No, it's out of play. A fraction too late on his cross. And it's gonna be a goal kick, and then I'll tell you what, an unnecessary bit of extracurriculars there from the goal scorer, Edwards, and his name is taken. Let's take a peek at his watch as the ball is poked back. And that is the last act of the half here at Providence Park. Well, Aaron Edwards scoring his first pro goal for the town. Has the visitors ahead, but it does not tell the full story. In the second half, the town are in all white with the black numerals, they kick us off. And the second half from Providence Park in Portland is off and running. Charles and Jacques, our entire crew, now here on Apple TV Plus tonight. We'll see if the town can maybe build on their advantage here. Good ball into the middle, Donnery. Holds it up. First time ball by Verhoeven. Great shot, and it's off both posts, and no, it doesn't go in. Well, it's wonderful build-up play. Donnery does ever so well. It's yet another piece of great service by Verhoeven. Wonderful attempt. Did that maybe. Between the goal was not given. Off both posts and out from Aaron Edwards. And then it's an overzealous challenge on the back end. It's a Portland free kick. I'm not sure you can get much closer. Hang around. It's another close call for them. Rod up ahead. Better is dealt with. Eisenberg in the midfield, a cushioned header, but. Comes the town again. Edwards. Tries to maybe go for goal, a bit of a nibble and a challenge. Now a set piece for the town, Blancas curls it beautifully and scores! The town's leading goal scorer from a season ago executes the free kick to perfection. You can't hit them much better than that. See it all the time. Players have a tough time getting it over the wall and then on target. Blancas had no such trouble. And now from the corner, Portland have more defending to do here. Chow on the recycle. Edwards back in. It's a chance for a third, and it's off the post from Bilter. But the flag is up. Would not have counted. Portland who had multiple opportunities and came so close for the town. It's being acquired on loan back in February. Made his professional debut back in 2017 and as play continued here, a challenge came in, a yellow card is out. Malcolm Johnston, the town. Another look at the sequence here, it was Edwards. He have already been on his way down, to be fair, but Johnston didn't need to hope. Goes past him. Penn trying to find the angle. Linares. Lovely skill again. He's pushed over. 
free kick, Portland. And then silly kick away by Verhoeven, and he's booked a lifeline here. 10 minutes into the start of the second half. Neville stands over the set piece. Great ball in, and it was flicked on by Blockus and out for a corner. Dangerous ball played in by Neville. Second try from the corner for Portland, and Ferdinand's in there, and his header is cleared off the six yard line. That was going on target. There were two white shirts there to block it. In the end, it's nearly Portland's moment, but not to be. And now Timbers 2 will make two changes. Noah Santos comes on. Victor Velasquez comes off. Here comes the town again. Ciao. Lovely give and go, Chow. Can he pick somebody out? Yes, he can. It's 3-0. Garcia. Right where he needed to be to tuck it home. And the town are on top at Providence Park. Just wonderful interplay here from the town. Chow with a lovely little one-two. Blanc is pulling the strings again. Two missed it. Garcia. Well, it might already be out of reach for Portland, but this would really shut the door. It's a missed header. Aaron Edwards back across Ferdinand. Crucial touch there to keep Portland hanging around. Now can the host get back into it at the other end? Eisenberg. Eisenberg lines a shot up. It's tame. Vigansky is there. Nice turn here. Chance for the shot by Donnery. Falls for Garcia. Garcia's shot is parried away by Miller. Out for a corner. Header is, in the end, snuffed out. Off the head of Verhoeven. Linares leads the Portland break. And he's brought down by Chow. That surely is going to lead to a booking. Referee on the scene with a yellow card. Things away from the pitch that have allowed the group to get along really well and come together, not just on the field, but off of it as well. As Portland are in the attack here, can they find a goal back? Oh my word, the answer is yes. And it's an absolute stunner from Kyle Linares. Stunning strike. Hope here in the dying embers, it's 3-1. I didn't have too many options here, Linares, but he scores a And it gives Portland something to cling on to. And now they win the ball back again. Portland are in again, and the shot is deflected and saved by Bogansky. My goodness. Mendoza curls the ball into the penalty area. It falls for a chance here. Santos! So close. Linares. He's been their spark. Challenge comes in. It is a yellow card for Sudahara. Another look is Kyle Linares has just been a handful for the town tonight. Rod switches the play. Jones Riley into the middle, and it's bundled wide. Penalty appeals from the Portland contingent here. Is that going to be a foul? Referee waves any appeals away as Santos fell to the ground. Santos gets the ball back here for Portland. Santos looking for the angle. Oh, tremendous save. Biganski keeping Portland at arm's himself in glory with a big save earlier he might have to be called upon again here's Pope it's gonna be Linares again but this time he drags his shot wide do they have a bye of course oh Pope gets it on the court on the poor clearance shot is cleared off the line 
Mendoza. Full time here in Portland. The town come into Providence Park and they leave with all three points. A very impressive result for Dan DeGeer's boys.